They just brought somebody out. Did you get it? Vern, they just brought a woman out. Get the light out! They may go to the airport. I'm not sure it's okay to make them. That's him. That's him. You'd like to do what? I said I'd like to thank the Grateful Dead. You'd like to thank, thank who? The Dead. The Grateful Dead. Uh, Happening? Boy, well, you're breaking my arm. Crazy. Great. Great. Yeah, yeah. Okay, John. Thank you. See you later. John.
right up. Okay. Are you going to bring him down again to the desk? Yes, we are. You know what I'm Ray, can you tell us why you did this? Can you just tell us why you did this? Excuse me. What do you mean? Oh, what the hell is this? Ouch, who's on my foot? Ouch, on my foot? No, definitely not. There's no violence involved in you know, any point. In, uh, and you didn't want it. Why did you do this? Are you trying to tell the public yeah. something? Yeah, I might, I might make a statement, you know, about why I did it at a later, you know, date in time, but I'm really not going to say anything about why I did it at this point. Well, you have to yes. now. Well, you're, you're right here it. now. You could tell. Did you, Ray? Any regrets at all, Ray? Yeah. We'll leave as soon as we get finished. What about your loved ones? No, no regrets. No regrets at all? No regrets. What about your family? What about yeah. your family? Your loved ones, right? No, I, I really don't have any uh, family you know, to speak of. What about your girlfriend? Okay. Your girlfriend. Did he offer any real resistance at that particular no, time? No, he was completely taken by surprise. And what did he say? Did he say anything at that point? No, he wouldn't say what he said anyway. Mm -hmm. Did he have a gun in his Did he have? I haven't got any of the details yet. We'll have it all at headquarters as soon as I can unravel it. Okay, sure. Everybody's going down. The circumstances were, but the conversation was working and distracting, and it made the opportunity available. To in other words, negotiations charge. broke down, and no, you have negotiations didn't break down. The ending is what counts, and any opportunity you can get to make the ending is uh, important. And in this case, once he was distracted, and the uh, Captain St. John had the opportunity, he seized it. But well, did your understanding earlier he was going to release all the hostages and come out? About an hour and a half or so ago. No, he didn't say anything. But he had seen like that, that. we had been reported been... that he was indeed ready to give up, and then he changed and forced some of the hostages to lie on the ground. They've all been lying on the ground since the beginning. He let a few go every uh, few, as you saw it, every few hours he let a few go. Uh -huh. Why did he le let few of these people go at a time? Why did he Part do that? Okay. Come on, let's go. Come on, out on the street. Let's go. Come on. Just as we entered the premise, they picked up what guns were laying around, and they were handed to us by hostages in the place. Which hostage made the move to get to the Well, they all simultaneously made it. Uh, they all were looking at each other, and they realized that it was their time to make the move that the guy had been getting drowsy. And they made what the move all together. Like Is getting drowsy from the beer that he had been drinking? Uh, apparently so. What, what kind of dialogue were you having with? 
Yeah. Well, it was, uh, it was really irrational. He seemed to wander from one thing to another. One time uh, he seemed like he was straight, at other times he seemed like he was in another world. He played his music, he was quiet. And he wouldn't answer, he would answer. It was just uh, very sporadic. Was he ever specific about what he wanted? Uh, no, he wasn't. Uh, he seemed to wander from one thing to another. He seemed very confused. Well, the hospital was in, in danger, really, at any time during the last hour or two. Oh, yes, they certainly were, because it, uh, during that last hour, there was the time that uh, he was moving around. He had the gun in his hand. He was waving it around. And uh, until he became drowsy in the last few minutes, uh, hostages were in danger right up to that point. Did he resist you at any time? Well, I think he was very surprised that we were in there. It was, uh, Our body down to the police the headquarters, Kenny. Uh, he was taken completely by uh, surprise. What did he say to you? He said nothing at all. He was very uh, rowdy. He said nothing. What do you mean,